guys, this is Bryony Parker here bringing you another video for El Nia Kingdom. So, since all of Hunter and Eliza's daughters have grown up, it is time to have a family time. So, we are going to go out on a family picnic. All of us as a family. As we go. Alright, and we're here, here in Fomos Forest. The entire family. Hunter, Eliza, Lena, Lena, and Amelia. Here we are. It's nice and cool here for a summer day. And they all get to look around and have a great time. Oh, just seeing Hunter and Eliza hang out. So sweet. Older Elena, who gets surprised by Bakoy. And the Elena and Amelia um, running away. <laughs> Or not running away, but running around, I mean. As Elena and Amelia have fun over there. Eating outside tastes way, way better. Yes, having a meal in a great place does make it taste better. I'm feeling like taking a nap. Let's all come here again sometime. Good idea. Oh, just seeing the entire family hanging out together is so precious. And, of course, with the other stuff I need to talk about. So, of course, Elena, the oldest one, will be turning into an adult pretty soon here. So, after the oldest Elena, this one right here I'm looking at right now, becomes an adult, we will talk about the plans for this... She'll hold still. There we go. For this Elena, who is my next generation. So, we will talk about her and the plans for her. And then a vote will be held for when I transfer to the Elena right here. So, I'll get back to you when the oldest Elena grows up. Alright guys, the time that Elena grows up. The coming of age ceremony. So the ceremony continues. Where is my little Elena? I don't see her anywhere here. Ah, whatever. We're going to skip through this. Do I want to transfer? No, I do not. Are you sure you want to progress without transfer? Yes. I am sure of that, and let us see what Elena looks like as an adult. The oldest, that is. That is not my future generation. And this is the oldest Elena, and oh my goodness, she is so pretty. And anyways, I will get back to you when I got her all in her outfit that I'm going to dress her in. Alright guys, I'm all finished. So, this is her final outfit, and she just looks so pretty. Oh my goodness, Hunter and, Eli or Hunter and Eliza had cute kids. Anyways, what she's wearing now is the clean cut marriage garments and the gardening flower crown. And on to something that I need to discuss because, well, I've been needing to discuss it for a while now. So, my future generation. So, the plans for the future generation and my future generation being this Elena right here. She will be my next generation because she has Eye of Carney and, and it just fits for being a scholar, really. And I wanted a talented kid for a scholar and I haven't covered it. So, and other plans. So, my plans are I will transfer. Okay, he's going to tell me that he is passing away soon. Okay, thanks, Pierre. Thank you for nothing because it's not going to matter to me. Anyways, anyways, that doesn't, that sounds cruel. Guys. I'm not trying to be cruel. I'm just trying to focus on what I'm talking about. Anyways, to the point I was talking about. So, basically, Elena is going to be my next generation for the scholar work again. And, of course, I'm going to wait until she is going to be turning into an adult, pretty much. Because by then, I can at least... Um, actually, no. Transferring to her before she's an adult. Never mind. What am I saying? Anyways, transferring to her before she's an adult, just a couple days before. And then, guys, I will give you one day or 24 hours to pick who Elena's future husband will be. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and I will see you on the other side.